What's up guys, Mr. Audio here, and welcome back to another video. If you're a music producer and you produce music at home, then this is the channel for you. Hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so be notified whenever I put out new content. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how to unmask your vocal to a pre-made beat so that you can hear it and it'll cut through the mix and you can turn that beat up while still keeping the presence of the vocal there. To do this, I'm gonna use Isotope's vocal assistant in Nectar 3 but I'm gonna be using the unmask function. To do this, you'll also need to download a free plugin from Isotope called Relay. I'll be using these two plugins in conjunction with each other to create an unmasking dynamic EQ that's side chained to the vocal. Let's get right to it and I'll show you how to do it. All right, so I have a track up here. It's another track by King Alpha. I work on his stuff quite a bit. Here's a beat that he sent me. There really wasn't room for the vocals with the frequency content that the beat had. So I'm gonna throw a Relay on the beat here, which we're going to use in a second, and then I'm going to go down to my vocal bus, where I have Nectar just sitting there with no settings on it at all because I've already got my settings dialed in on the vocal tracks themselves. Now I'm going to click on Vocal Assistant here, I'm going to click the Unmask function, and then we're going to select a source, and we're going to select the track we just put the relay on. We're going to hit Next, and I'm going to choose a portion of the track where it's part of, partly in the verse and going into the chorus so that it gets a good idea of what kind of frequency content the vocals are going to carry. All right, so let's uh, give it a play. As you can see here, no settings have changed in Nectar. So I'm going to exit that. We're going to go back up to the relay. And as you can see now, it has an unmasked function. Now we're going to listen to this. With my hands, so it's not boring. And I'm gonna set this to dynamic here. Building thoughts about our future, so I'm paying for it. Going outside in the cold for the bag. Shorty, I ain't finna get no rest. Even if you're grateful for the shit that we have. Shorty, I ain't finna get no rest. Now, do you hear that uh, vocal like chop that goes from side to side? It's kind of like weird and distorted. Well, notice how the volume rises when I turn the unmasking off. And now I can even push the beat a little bit harder too. And if the beat sounds a little overpowering, increase the percentage of the dynamic sidechain. And as you can see, I'm exaggerating it. My settings would be more like... My side is going to be more like this. Alright. So as you can see, it's unmasked the vocal quite a bit. It makes the vocal pop out through the mix. Well, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you use these tools to help your vocals cut through the mix. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Mr. Audio, out.